Individuals in Bowling Green are getting displaced from their encampments due to the property owners evicting them. WBKO reporter Presley Allen spoke with a ministry group that advocates for this homeless population, as well as a homeless individual who was recently displaced. It's our top story at six. I'm here at a homeless encampment, which in just two weeks will look like this. Recently, homeless encampments have been getting demolished by companies that own the properties being occupied, giving those who reside there two weeks to pack up and leave. Robert Jones is a part of the homeless community and was recently displaced from an encampment. Having a service animal has made it difficult for him to have access to some shelters. Well, you're gonna pack a life up in a matter of moments. So a lot of stuff was left behind. Having a service dog, I didn't have a plan. They don't, they don't allow pets is what they put it. And it's not a pet, it's a service animal. Um, this is the dog that identifies and saves my life. Timothy Hayes resides in the homeless community as well and was told just this morning that his encampment was being bulldozed and that everyone living there would have to evacuate. They did not have any place for us to go. They, they didn't give us any, really any options. And I mean, it wasn't their place to, I understand, it's not their place to give us options. But this, this is gonna be up to us. And, but there are not a whole lot of places we can legally be in Bowling Green. Amid the situation, what is being called Do Not Forget Me Ministries has been formed. Co-founder Chris York explained the group is actively trying to help the homeless population, including those like Hayes and Jones, who feel they have nowhere to go. Basically, all we really want to do is just like reach out to the community to ask you guys what we can do to come together as a community to help these people that, and that need help. That these are all children of God that just really need, need help. And we want to be able to help them and we want to be able to provide them with things in order for them to be able to transition and have places to go or do things for themselves. If you are interested in donating to Do Not Forget Me Ministries, the information can be found on our website, WBKO.com. Reporting from Bowling Green, Kentucky, this is Presley Allen with WBKO News. In terms of donations, the ministry is asking for blankets, tents, sleeping bags, water, tarps, and power converters.